Hello, my name is Mike Wilkinson. Um, I'm submitting this video for the 3D printer competition. Um, I'd like to enter my homemade wind turbine and uh, off-grid power station um, for the competition if I could. I've been watching your channel for about uh, a year or so and all of your wind turbine videos uh, inspired the creation of this. Um, okay, I'll try and run through it as quickly as possible to keep the video short. Um, we'll go up and we'll have a look. Okay, so this is made out of um, an old kid's trampoline um, some sewage pipe cut into fins and some drainage pipe. Um, in the centre is uh, two kids bicycle wheels and the uh, braking system is also robbed from the uh, from the kids bike as well although it needs a bit of work. I'm, I'm still working on this at the moment. Um, it's, it's run on a, a very simple belt using uh, just, just rubber vacuum tube, um, an old-fashioned flexible curtain rail um, and uh, that there is a, a little 300 watt uh, three-phase AC generator. Now that's, the three phases are wired coming inside through the wall into the uh, little control room in here where, uh, where it's coming into this little control unit here, rectifier basically, which switches it to DC and it charges the battery bank down here. Now it's a combination wind and solar, so there is three solar panels just over the wall over there that are also charging the system, and this is the control unit for those solar panels. Um, so this is system voltage, overall system uh, voltage uh, at the moment, and you can see that what's coming in from the solar there is, is almost uh, the same. Um, basically, uh, what I've got then is it's running into this nice big juicy inverter here, which switches it up to uh, up to the 230, which then just runs through here and into the house. Now, goes along the wire there, up along the wall, up and into the attic, and uh, I'll try and keep this as short as possible just before I go inside, uh, just for the uh, sake of the competition. Okay. LED has been lit. <laughs> That's just the work light for in there. But I'm also going to run into the house real quick because we are currently running the fridge on this system. So here's the refrigerator. That's the standard mains that's in the house. Here is the secondary sockets. I'm sorry, the video is a bit blurry at the minute. This is the secondary sockets, which basically is the wire coming down from the attic where it's in a, in a splitter box up there. I believe that's an LED um, and you can see the fridge is running. Okay, hope this video is suitable. Um, if, if you want a better video, please let me know. Um, and uh, yeah, thanks for doing the competition and thanks for the inspiration overall. Um, I wouldn't have built this if I hadn't uh, been watching your channel. And as you can see, it's absolutely flying there at the minute. The wooden frame is just 4x2 timbers that I put together. Same with the lower structure. Um, it's 4x4 four four pillars and uh, just, just timber basically is all it is. Um, okay, uh, thanks again and uh, cheers, bye.